playing and I do sound for television. Okay. And what TV shows are you working on right now? I just finished working on a show called Big Boys with um, Elaine Overholt, who's the vocal coach for The Star. She worked on like Chicago and a bunch of other things, uh, coaching actors to become singers. So she's taking middle-aged ladies and kind of helping them find their dream. Um, it's going to be on W Network. It's pretty fabulous. We had a, we had a, a finale performance last night at uh, what's it called, the Great Hall on Dovercourt. With Ron Sexsmith and Liz West, who used to be on City TV, they did a duet. It was really cute. Yeah, yeah. it's a good show with like high production values. It's really cute set, and we'll have like a couple characters in the scene. Like in, in the show that I was working on, Big Voice, you'd have the the woman, the candidate, and then Elaine. So I'd get there and I'd mic both of them up. So I'd like kind of fill them up and then place a mic like hide it in the clothes. Because um, in most reality style television now, you like it's. Everybody ignores the camera, you know what I mean? So you can't have any uh, elements of production that are visible, so I have to hide the lab like, somehow creatively, whether it's like in their hair, up in their bangs here, or somewhere in like a scarf or whatever. Um, and then we shoot the scenes, and sometimes I boom, and that's about it. I don't know. No, that's great. <laughs> I don't know how to describe my job very well. <laughs> Um, any other TV shows you worked on in the past? Or? I worked on Project Runway, um, season one and two, which was, that was really fun. Like, I mean, as much as, like, it's really neat to follow the fashion and stuff and see, like, see people just take nothing and make it into a beautiful garment, it was also interesting to kind of, um, have, like, 13 people mic and listen to them all, like, going into other rooms and talking about each other and, like, it's, it's socially really weird when people forget that they're mic'd and they just like get into this mode and they're on camera for 20 hours of the day and the other four hours they're sleeping. So like they don't have any privacy. So it's kind of like really voyeuristic, which is definitely an aspect of doing sound that I enjoy. Do you 